thank you to the people who gave me constructive feedback, to the people who are just calling me a scammer, um, a bitch, a liar, you know, you're gonna steal the money. Seriously, step off. We fell out of love like shooting stars came crashing down And we're building back up again now I see your heart, see your mind, see all you hide I won't let you go, can't let this die When you lose yourself, I'll be right beside you I see your heart, see your mind, see all you hide so I just repotted one of our new plants and put it in this glass vase because I kind of, I just, I like the look. I like to see the roots. It's pretty cool. And um, I've got like a charcoal layer. So the rot, the um, the roots don't rot. So there's, you know, some sort of drainage down the bottom. So we'll see how that goes. So now we've got the green pot and we've got the clear pot. I kind of like the clear pot look. The vase look is pretty cool. What do you think? Tell me in the comments below. Okay, so I'm using this green wall freestanding bench top planting kit and I put my little lettuce green mignonette into here. This little system, we're going to see how it goes. Ideally, I want to cover that like lettuce just with lettuce. Cover the lettuce with lettuce. That would be awesome. Just all up there. The green pots have been growing on me and so many of you BBs in the comments dig the green pots. So I'm like, I'm going to go with the peer pressure, go with the green pots. You know those days where you just don't want to clean? Well, I had one of those last night. Just pile it all up there. New box of bananas. Ten bananas. Coconut sugar. And ten dates. That's the beach. So we're just out and about. What are we doing, Mum? Going shopping. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Going shopping for some groceries. Um, mate, we were gonna go for a swim, but Mum and Duff forgot her togs, her yes. bikini. Yeah. So you're gonna go in nude? Uh, no. Yeah. Maybe we Free can, the nipple. Maybe we can go to the op shop and I'll find something I can put on. No, oh, we could do that. <laughs> All right, let's see what we can do. So it's cold now, isn't it, Mum? It's a bit. <laughs> <laughs> it's chilly, but we still got this. We're still gonna go for a swim. It's gonna be nice and refreshing. Yes, refreshing. Yeah. Sure. So I just cracked my phone. Oh. In the corner, oh. so I dropped it. So I was trying to get it into this selfie stick. Crazy, crazy selfie stick. I'm your daughter. Looking down from the heights that we have built all by ourselves. Little chilly, little chilly. So my phone doesn't fall in the water. Secondhand bikini, and she's not that happy with it. I think it looks really nice. Yeah. Look, it looks so nice. Not a bikini. <laughs> oh, yeah, one piece. I think it looks really good. Yeah. Mum's hot. She's rocking it. A little bush turkey. Or she. Probably a she making a nest. Oh, hey. <laughs> this is cute. Definitely used to people, this one. Oh, yeah, they're used to people. You <laughs> <laughs> got hit by something. <laughs> it's really funny. <laughs> Wash the feet off. Check out that arch. Valeria's arch. 
Hey BB, so I just woke up not long ago and I was thinking about the whole Patreon thing, the video that I did yesterday, and some of the comments were just like, holy fuck, like I know I get comments from haters all the time, but like some of them like, oh Freely's a scammer, she's gonna steal your money, she's a fraud, she's a liar, don't give her any money, like just all this ranting, and I'm like, holy shit, I can't believe I'm sharing the planet with people like this. I literally cannot believe it. You know, when someone is trying to do a selfless thing, a selfless act, they're trying to do something good for the animals, for the planet, actually trying to help, and there's people who, you know, try and turn that into a horrible thing, try and turn it into a bad thing, something that is literally so good into something that is so bad. That just, that really, really shocks me. Still to this day, it does shock me. I guess it shouldn't by this point, but it does. And, um, I mean, like, I'm open to constructive criticism for sure. Like, I saw some comments from people saying, oh, you know, why don't you post directly a link directly to the foundation? And I am totally fine with that. You know, I want them to get the money, obviously. But what I thought was, like, a neat idea is that we show how much money is being pledged each month. And this is, like, a rolling thing. So each month it comes out of the account, and then I can direct it to different sanctuaries around the world. I thought, hey, this is a really fucking cool idea. And people can see how much that they're, they're pledging pledging and everyone can get excited about that whereas if it's going directly to the sanctuary you can't actually see that and each month I can't direct that rolling amount to these different sanctuaries so I did have a, an idea in mind for that and I was really excited about it and I'm still excited about it but something has to change on this because you know some of you did give me some good feedback and said oh Patreon takes money and PayPal takes money and all the money isn't going to go to these sanctuaries and I'm like that's shit that's, you know, that is not good because I want all your money to go directly to them. And, you know, that obviously is the best. But the reason, you know, for not having a direct link is most people aren't going to go and donate. Okay, most people aren't. If it's a, patri a public Patreon account, then they are more likely to. And that's why we saw, I think it's something like over $700 you guys have pledged per month so far. And um, I think a couple of hundred dollars went directly. So some of you went directly to... Um, Freedom Hill Farm Sanctuary, which is awesome. I'm so glad that you did that. But so much more went to the, the pledge, the public pledge account. And if people don't think I'm going to give the money to these sanctuaries, they can, A, like, ring them. You can see if the public, public like, it's publicly, you know, put out there. So if that public amount that I've pledged doesn't go directly to the sanctuary, duh, you know, you can just ring them up and check. And I'm, you know, definitely going to show any sort of proof that's needed, like invoice, whatever. But this is what we come to because of this amount that is being taken out. I'm thinking, I don't know if this is the best idea anymore. You know, I was excited at first. I thought it was a really good idea. And I still think it's a good idea, but maybe it's not the most efficient way to do it because of the fact that Patreon and PayPal is going to take a big chunk. So I think I'm going to have to stop this after this first month and, you know, pass your money on to them and then stop it. And then probably just say each month, okay, we're going to choose this sanctuary and please donate to them. I know less people are going to donate because it's not going to be a public Patreon account, but I still think it's going to be good. It's definitely going to be better than nothing. And there's some people who think that I'm going to benefit big time out of this. Actually, no, there's no benefit to me at all other than the fact that I get to help these sanctuaries. I get to help connect people, my, my audience, with these sanctuaries. That is the benefit to me. There is no financial gain. If not, if anything, you know, I'd have to pay out of my own pocket. So please, you know, get a grip. Thank you to the people who gave me constructive feedback, to the people who are just calling me a scammer, um, a bitch, a liar, you know, you're going to steal the money. Seriously, step off and watch someone else because, you know, I'm not interested in your hater feedback because I know it's not coming from a good place. It's coming from a place of hate within your heart and you need to sort that out okay you don't need to sort it out on my page you need to go and look in the mirror and sort that out yourself because you're not actually trying to help the situation you're just trying to hate and everybody can see that so just work on yourself all right so anyway that's where we're up to thank you so much to those of you who donated like you restore my faith in the human race you really do like you know, you get what I'm about, you get what I'm trying to do, you're not projecting jealousy, you're not projecting insecurity or anything like that, you're just saying, hey, this is a great idea, thank you freely, I'm going to try, this. I mean, I'm going to help, and you donated, and I think you're wonderful people, so, like, thanks for being part of this team, this family, this channel, whatever you like to call it, because you're the type of people I want, like, on my team, for sure. So, I hope all that made sense.
that's where we're at now. Um, tried to do a good thing. I was really excited about it. I still think it's a good thing. I don't think it's the most efficient way to do it. So we're now going to, after that money is paid out, I'm going to cancel that. And then we're going to do like each month, I'm going to say, hey, let's focus on this sanctuary, give a little like blurb on them, a little summary, and then we can donate to them each month. So let us know in the comments what, what you think. And that's where we're up to. All right. Um, I, this video is late. It's actually like, you know, half a day late or something. So I'm going to put it up now and I love you guys. And I love you guys who donated. You are just incredible. You keep me strong. You're a part of the team and I love you. So, and I will see you soon. And I'm going to go to the gym now. So you see some gym footage tomorrow. All right. Bye guys.